This is a tool that we use in all of our meetings that is super impactful. Um, so just to, to sort of orient you for where we are right here, this is 4th Street right in front, and then this is the main entrance to the arena where about 80% of traffic is, is likely to come through. So jumping in, uh, on the event level itself, everybody's gonna be funneled into this main atrium area, which is gonna be wide open and expansive. On the north side, you've got a VIP entrance for folks sitting in the first four rows, and they have access to the event level club, which, uh, as you can see, is actually connected directly to the player tunnel, which is a very unique feature of the arena. Going up to the mezzanine level, this is a level dedicated um, to one single club, which you can see in this horseshoe here. And this services people sitting in the center six rows of the lower bowl. So if you take a dive into this seat right here, you'd go through these two vomitories on, on that opposite side and these two on this side, go around that horseshoe and go to a club that has capacity for about a thousand people. Going up to the main concourse, this is where most of the guests are gonna spend their time. So on the main concourse, about 75% of the concourse traffic is wide open to the bowl. So if you're standing over here at this bar and you're grabbing a beer, you can still see into the game and actually watch the action. Going up to the suite level, so on the east side, you've got the lofts, and then on the west side, you've got group party suites. So these are both great for concerts, events, and Bucks games as well. On the upper concourse, similar to the, to the main concourse, this is wide open. So uh, if you're up here, any time that you're out onto the concourse, you can grab something to drink, something to eat, and still see into the game. What's really important is everybody is much closer to the action. Especially in the upper concourse, it's really important because everybody who's walking into the game is actually walking down to their seat. So the bowl is flipped here. So that means that in the BMO Harris Bradley Center, there were 10,000 seats in the upper bowl. This one has 6,000 in the upper bowl and 10,000 lower, so it creates a much more intimate fan experience. And then the last level, which we're really excited about, which we think is really unique in downtown Milwaukee, is what we call the Sky Mezzanine level. So this has a club that services four to 500 guests. We're really excited about non-event days, for people to rent this out for weddings, for um, parties, for corporate events, and this will actually give you views to the east side of downtown and everywhere in the city.